Hi, this is Alan Baines from Birth on USA and welcome to our video tour of the brand new Moody 41 Dexalon as she was just introduced at the Dusseldorf Boat Show in January 2020. First going down the starboard side, the Bill Dixon hull has a nice soft chine at the back. Sail drive is standard with two engine size options, single rudder and a bulb keel of either shallow or deep. Twin windows for the guest cabin there. And then going forward, a large single window either side for the owner's cabin. Bow thruster is standard and modern plumb bow with a stainless anchor roller. This boat has the standard moody colours, which are a white hull with a moody beige grey stripes. The specs are available on our website and there's the various interior optional layouts you can have. Side profile. It's a big 41 foot boat. Walking back aft, another view of the sail drive. This boat has a rub rail. Now we're up at deck level, looking at the cockpit with the twin wheels, twin pedestals winch and furler controls on the pedestals, bow thruster controls. And like her bigger sisters has the fiberglass bridge overhangs with the sliding bimini in between. There's an opening window by the galley. Twin seats in the cockpit either side with huge lockers underneath. Helm seat with an enclosing guardrail. Solid lifeline rails, which is a feature of the Dexalon Moody's and a fold down boarding ladder. Going up the side deck, which gently slopes, this has a teak covering, which is standard. You can also have flexi teak. There's the self tacking jib track and the sunbed. Going forward to the forward entertainment cockpit, which is unique, I think, on this boat. And it'll be a great place to hang out for cocktails when you're at anchor at sunset. Looking back to the deck salon, over the top of the sunbed, there's the opening hatch for the owner's bathroom. Anchor locker with room for fenders, stowage, double roller. Now walking down the side deck on the starboard side. You can see all the sail controls are led back to the cockpit on either side. Electric winches are standard. Rear view of the cockpit and shortly we'll lift up the lazarette to show you inside that. You see the swim platform there in its upright position. Room in there for a rolled up dinghy or a life raft and access to the steering underneath the hatch inside it. Yanmar sail drive is standard. Now we're inside the deck salon, deck house. 
270 degree visibility around the front and sides. Chart table forward facing on the port side with the inside controls which are optional. Padded little side locker. A very comfortable place to pilot the boat in bad weather. L-shaped galley with a three burner stove and the top and the front loaded familiar fridge that uh, Hansi uses. The double sink. Slide out trash bin in the table pedestal and optional dishwasher under the back end of the settee. Recessed lighting overhead gives a lovely ambience to the deck salon. Now we're going down to the staterooms forward. This boat has a light oak interior, making it light and very airy inside. Owner's cabin is huge for the size of boat. Walk around bed, you can see the inside of the windows there. And to the head with a stall shower partitioned off with a glass partition. A lot of storage in the owner's cabin in this boat. On the starboard side there's floor to ceiling shelves. A recessed tray for sort of jewellery and cell phones etc. That's on both sides. Controls for the lights up forward next to the bed. The lights are all on dimmers. And on the port side, there's three floor to ceiling lockers. Two are shelves and one is a hanging locker. There's so plenty of places for all your clothes for an extended trip aboard. Rearmost one has a mirror on the inside of the door. and the lockers are backlit. Moving aft now, back into the passageway and into the guest cabin, which on this boat has two single berths, but you can also have a double. Plenty of room in here, lots of light with the two side windows and an opening hatch into the cockpit. Plenty of storage as well with a hanging locker and shelves. All backlit underneath for a very nice ambience. This boat has the optional second head, which could also be a work room or storage. Basically a mirror image of the owner's head and shower. electric toilet on these boats. Now going back up the passageway past the electrical panel, up to the deck salon, and uh, about to show you the underfloor storage. be a pantry or I think room for a, for a washing machine down there. It's sort of crouch headroom when you get in there but there's lots of storage and then on the forward end there is uh, room for various electrical technical pieces. Back up showing the inside of the deck salon and galley area. A 
And now we're at the end of our tour. We hope you like it. If you would like more info, please call or email us at birthonusa.com.